So am I a bastard? I'm always right. In the mall. Give me two dollars. <laughs> the sky's clear. Oh, we've got four telescopes so far. Should be optimistic. Well, this is the situation. We're in the cafe here, and uh, Yuko's feet are exposed. Let's have a look here. There we go. Yuko's feet exposed, and uh, she feels cold. You know, feet are cold. So she asked me if she could borrow my jacket, this one, to keep her feet warm. But I refused, obviously. I don't, want, I don't want my jacket down there, basically on the floor. She asked me if she could use my jacket, and I said no, and you know, she waited 10 minutes, suffering with cold feet. Finally, she decided to use her own jacket. What do you think about this situation? So am I a bastard for refusing to give her my jacket? Tell me in the comments. I'm right. I'm always right. I'm right. I'm always right. You are wrong. You're always wrong. You are wrong. Anyway, I love you. Even if you think I'm a bastard. You are a bastard anyway. Still, I love you. You are only my subordinate. Yuka has been gardening. She filled up the garbage bin with garden waste, and uh, it's garbage day. Mm. And uh, I think it's mm. too heavy. I think not. There's a 90 kilogram limit, and uh, once before they, they refused to take it because it was too heavy. Yeah. But uh, Yuka wants to gamble. Yeah. So uh, if they don't take it, I get one dollar. <laughs> if I'm, I win, you should pay two dollars. Two to one? Mm. I, I have more gamble. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm going to put it out now. Here's the bin. All right. As you can see, I apologize. Yeah, you apologize. Yeah, I'm gonna give me two dollars. Give me two dollars. I'll, I'll give you two dollars at some mm. point. Mm. See? Do you accept cash? Yeah, cash is alright. Mm. I, I don't have any cash. Sure. Later. Well, I'm at Penrith and it's astronomy night tonight at the university. But uh, Yuko sent me to the shopping centre first to get um, some more of those hairpin things and some glue. Um, so I'm in the two dollar shop found the glue and uh, now she wants some butterfly hairpins it's like a wonderland here it's a wonderland and uh, Yuko also asked me to buy her a, a phone cover so she can decorate it again with these uh, sparkling things so I got that $15 it's pretty good in the mall, up and down the escalators in the mall, got a hankering for potatoes in the mall, in the mall. It's just on closing time here in the mall, as the shops are closing. It's a big TV there, it's vertical. I hate vertical video. It's another astronomy night, and for the first time this year, I think, the sky's clear. It's incredible. 
and uh, the moon is uh, where is it there and it's a gibbous moon tonight which generally isn't good because it makes everything uh, everything else harder to see but for showing people who've never seen it before the gibbous moon is quite good quite spectacular and Jupiter will be up as well so uh, we'll have a couple of bright things to look at maybe we'll also look at some clusters and shit I've got, uh, I've got four telescopes so far Probably a couple more coming, don't worry about me, I'm just talking to myself he, he knows me, he knows me um, yeah I think we're gonna have about six telescopes tonight actually I think we've got four already and uh, probably another two coming Look at this huge instrument. It's an 11 inch. It's an 11 inch. Actually, mine's 12. But you know, you know, this one looks more impressive, doesn't it? It's like it's right, it's right up there, whereas mine's sort of just down on the ground. You know, it's just. But it's the same size, isn't it? Or yours is bigger? Mine's bigger. Mine's 12. There you go, how about that? Cool, how'd you do that? <laughs> <laughs> and that's not zoomed in either. 